Okay, so Scorpio North Node lesson: How to have limitless power. Um, you know, flip the camera real quick. One, self control. No power comes without self control. Two. Fearlessness. Now, um, this has to come in proportion because this could be naivete, if not, uh, if not fully developed in logic. Now, I've learned um, fearlessness has to more do with emotion. And sharp logic. What that means is. Um, that means you. When it comes to sharp. Sharp logic is. The ability. To focus. To only focus. On things that add up to a better future. To your better future. Um, and subtract things that don't add up to your better future. Um, but you must also be logical enough to be detached from all outcomes. Because all logic, well, not all logic, let me see, not all logic, that's, that, that's, that's too preposterous. Um, logic can be debunked if something greater comes along. Get what I mean? So right now, the logic of the time is that we drive cars on the floor. Then 30, 40 years from now, we have automatic cars on most, like, mostly on the road. Then we have flying cars 100 years from now. Because that logic is being debunked or kicked to the curb. Um, I would say three, emotional awareness. And IQ, because I learned that you, I've learned this is so important because like, especially when it comes to women, I've learned that you must have a level of emotional IQ because like when you have, it, cause like for instance, I had a, I had a Libra who was saying some toxic shit and I was able to have a certain emotional IQ where it didn't matter what she said. If I know she knew it didn't matter. Um, if I knew, if I knew what she said was toxic, I, I debunked it immediately. And I was like, yo, that's toxic. First of all, that's attachment. That's not connection, for instance. Like, she would say stuff that's based on attachment, not connection. Like, for instance, if, if you threaten your, 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 your significant other from not talking to you daily, you have more of an attachment than a connection. There's something about you that's not complete. 
because you should crave no human unless they are your children to see them every day. Because your children are your personal responsibility. I mean, after a certain age, before, before a certain age. And I say that because I don't speak to my parents. And at one point, if I went, if I went a day or two or three or four or five without talking to my parents, that would be an issue because they they would be my responsibility. Um, and now that I don't, now that that's not, that's not here, I don't think you need to speak to any adult every day. Um, unless they are productively helping you towards a brighter future, like I said earlier. Um, um, four would be, uh, a, an unquenchable thirst. That's what's the unquenchable thirst. For knowledge. And this is something that you can develop. I don't think you're born with this. Some people, some people more than others. I, I'm not, I don't have an unquenchable thirst for knowledge. Um, for me, I have to develop it because I can, ver- I can get very comfortable in my, my laurels. And in what I know, because I have a Taurus and Mercury. So because I have Taurus and Mercury. Um, because I get tor- I have Taurus and Mercury, I can easily say, nah, I know enough. I'm good. I don't need to study no more. I don't need to read no more. I don't need to. I don't need to learn no more because what, um, what has been what I know brings me money and comfort. Um, five. Um. Purpose. Six. Legacy. Seven. Healthy relationships. Underline healthy relationships. Underline healthy. Excuse me. And eight. Um... Purpose and plan planning, because I'm learning how important planning is. Even though, even though when I hear my Earth signs like Earth signs plan, I'm like, damn, I wish I had a better. I wish I could plan like you. Um, <laughs> uh, I could stick to that plan like you. Um, eight. Um, um. Relationship with God. Or the infinite within. So... Five would be purpose. Um, like you, you have to have a purpose in what you do, like, like for your sex life, your emotional life, your mental life, and every part of your life. Purpose gives you direction, and it also gives you the ability to. And this is not spoke about often. the The ability to eliminate. Because with purpose, with direction, gives you the to say that's gonna knock me off direction, so I can't fuck with it, you know. And proper planning, um, which which is really preparation, 
because I've I had to accept um, success loves preparation, um, and if you don't if you don't prepare, you plan to fail. Like where I'm at is no accident. Like you need to get to a place where you can plan how much income you're gonna make, and it's not an accident or by coincidence or or by great momentum but it's actually scheduled out how much you're going to make and you can predict it um because yeah because we go from planning to preparation to prediction but you can't get to prediction that's the, i guess that's the P, the ppp I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a video on that the p p p of practicality and that's like um Virgo and Chiron <laughs> so without proper planning you don't prepare so like when so let's say if you know the plan is to get to Arizona and you're in Atlanta, you need to prepare a certain way, whether it be food, money, um, snacks, um, sleep, where you're gonna stay, hotels, etc. etc. Um, stop stop, stop places, etc. etc. So you can predict almost how what what's gonna happen. You can almost have an expectation. And it doesn't always go, it is not always, uh, uh, right, but you want to have some sort of that so you can have practicality in your life. Um, eight, legacy. I'm, I'm a firm believer in legacy or the long game. And I play a I play a lot of the long game. Um, I don't really play the short game, meaning, uh, delayed gratification. I'm oh, sorry. Delay gratification. So short the short game is everything is right now. Even though as an impulsive person, I love the right now game, which means presence. But um which means presence. Uh, mm -hmm. but the short game <clears throat> just means right now everything has to be immediate and what what trips me out is like because I'm I could be very emotionally practical is the long game includes and I and I, I get it now you have to master the PPP because if you don't, the delay will fuck you up. The delay will think, ooh, ooh, shit. The delay will make you think you're going nowhere. And as Ajna would say, sometimes delay means you need to be, you need better preparation. Real talk. <laughs> okay. But that's cop for another time. Relationship, uh, I would say healthy relationships. Uh, and this is very short, but the greatest wealth is relationships. Um, so sometimes it's not about what you know, how much money you have, what you can do. It's about the relate the healthy relationships you can build to gain wealth and to gain power. Um, and relationship with God or the infinite within. I think as you hear Shreem Razi. Um, I think that you are you are a infinite being in a finite body. And uh and you have to tap into the infinite you know, within yourself, meaning you you are you are a vibrational
being. And understand that everything is vibration. And that and it's not like spooky, it's the truth. Everything is vibration. And you need to understand that to move to have a certain amount of success um in this world. If you if you ignore vibration, you 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 take everything literal. And that's that's a quick way to be a victim. Or like or be limited or only believe in your finite body or your finite body's experiences but if you want to book a session go to bit.ly slash astrology form bit.ly slash astrology form astrology form in all caps and um or comment 1333 below for your manifestation guide